Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you how to get this perfect red lip. So stay tuned and keep on watching. As you guys know, Fenty Beauty came out with a new red lipstick and I had to come on here and give you guys a little bit of a review slash demo-ish kind of video as well as show you guys how to do a perfect red lip for the holidays because who doesn't love a perfect red lip? So the first step is to moisturize or prime your skin and I'm using the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Primer. I like to just use this before I put on my foundation because skin prep is very important. The next step is to color correct the area. Color correction gives you a very nice base for your lipstick. I like to just color correct around my mustache area. We all know as women we have a little bit of a dark um, upper lip and if you color correct that area it makes your red lipstick pop a little more. Color correcting gives you a great base for your lipstick. Even if you are not somebody who wears a lot of foundation, at least put some on so that you can get a nice popping red lip. If you've noticed that your red lips don't stand out, especially when you just put them on with skin that doesn't have foundation on, this is what you need to do. So just for the holidays, if you're going for a holiday party, it's very important to follow these steps and you will be looking popping and you'll be looking flawless. So. <laughs> Next thing I do is I put on my foundation. I'm using the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Foundation in 420 and I also mixed a little bit of 410 and I use the Fenty Beauty sponge to just blend that all out. When you're done blending all that out, you want to start with lip lining. Now, it's not necessary for you to use lip liner if you don't want to. The way the wand of the lipstick is shaped, you can actually just go in and use it. But I just wanted to give myself a guideline to put the lipstick on. This is current lip liner by MAC. Now let's get into this mini review. This is the packaging for the Fenty Beauty Stunna lip paint in uncensored. I really like it. It looks like a it looks like a nail polish, which I really love. This is what you are getting inside. The applicator is really nice. It has a point and it also has a dip in it that hugs your lip for easy application. It was very weird when I first pulled it out. I was like, wow, this is kind of cool. So honestly, the color payoff is amazing. When you put one coat on, it that's really all you need however i'm extra so i went ahead and put on multiple coats so i just like to stay within the lip line and just lightly place my lipstick in all the areas where the lip liner is not so if you want an ombre effect you can definitely use a darker liner and that will give you a nice ombre effect which is great for holidays also i thought it was actually going to be more orange based but it's more blue based and more blue based reds i feel like look really nice on brown skin and honestly any skin in general how long does this wear that's what everybody's asking yesterday i wore it for a total of about six hours it says it's supposed to be 12 hour wear however when i wore this it really does last very long most of my lipsticks when i wear them i would eat maybe i would kiss banji that kind of thing and next thing i know the lipstick is gone it has good staying power so I hope you guys enjoyed this mini tutorial on how to get the perfect holiday red lip. If you want any more lip tutorials, leave them down below and I would love to do them for you. So have a great holiday guys. Bye. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute.